Looking right above center court here in Conti form, and we are underway tonight in this matchup. Eagles have it here, and underneath the basket, and the kick out to Chapman, one of the most dangerous three-point shooters as well, along with Bowman. And here he is, first one up, first one good. Tabs trying to feed the cutter, get knocked away. Here comes Reeves. And the finish is there from David Duke. Underneath, and an easy one there on the feed, getting down to Young. And I think really love playing for Coach Cooley. Pass taken away. Tabs. Oh, nifty move. It's a side uh, for Winston Tabs right here, just being active in the passing lane, and then he's off to the races, sensing somebody behind him, and real difficulty off the chart that time uh, for the freshman, Tabs. Looking for the tie here. David Duke knocks it down for Providence. Yeah, went off for 28 points the last time out and providing uh, that extra scoring boost for Boston College and Jim Christian. And finally pulled away by Stephon Mitchell for Boston College. And it's Chapman. Tie the game at nine. Chapman that time showing some nice body control, taking the hit and then finishing with the opposite hand. Three ball in the corner, Reeves, yes. Of players that are 6-1 or less, there's only one of three in the country where he's averaging 6.7 rebounds or more a game. That shows you his skills, as you're right. Miss was the ally for three. He's still scoreless here in this first half, as is Kai Bowman, who's the top player for BC. And the ball trickles out to BC, and here they come, Mitchell. Chapman with the up and under, wow. Three-pointer in the corner now by the Friars, and that's Malik White. Use their size advantage with their guards and also forwards to try to get a lot of easy books, looks around the basket. And one of the better scorers of four freshmen in the country. He kicks it out to White, who misses on the three, and the rebound put down by Jimmy Nichols. Powering his way inside is Watson, and couldn't get the roll. Bowman. Head of steam, and he's fouled. Bowman, remember, has two fouls right now. There's still over nine minutes to go in this first half. And they're trying to feed Watson, and he converts it this time. Well, not an easy task, but certainly he's just so talented. Reeves, tough shot underneath. Watson for the tip. Again, count it. The lottery last year, uh, taking a lot of pressure off him. He's not getting as many open looks as he did last year. Diallo on the feed for the top, and Watson has been... Pushing his authority down low. Three-pointer. Got it. And in the corner is Isaiah Jackson. Bowman along three. Good offensive rebound. Mitchell keeps it alive. Now another three ball. This is good by Chris Heron, Jr., the freshman. This year, Boston College lost by 20 at Providence at the end of November. I mean, they don't forget about that. Absolutely not. You have this date marked. Mitchell. Back to Heron for three. Got it! Ten-nothing run by Boston College. you got going to take it away by Mitchell. Bowman to Chapman. And a foul called. Mitchell's got the rebound. Heron, look out. Game's also on the ESPN app. Watch it anywhere that you are. Inside Watson. How about right back to his presence, Malcolm? That was a big story. God wants Heron to take every shot right now, right? <laughs> well, why not? He has been perfect. Here's a pull-up from Tabs. Yes. Combined to work seven Final Fours, and that's the thing. You can watch anything all you want and replay. I mean... 99% of the time, they get it right. And especially at real speed, it's tough. It was fantastic in the first half. Here is Chapman off a screen. Tough contested shot, but he nails it. Most double-digit rebounds in the first half. Uh, I say that's pretty impressive for the young fella. Tip ball off and in by Young for Providence. Offensive rebound, BC. Bowman with a step. White. Oh, nice 
nice offensive rebound put back it in by Diallo. See if they try to get it down to Watson again. Instead, on the spin, it's Diallo, and now really probably started to think, i got to take over a little bit here now and, and get to the bucket. How about a great game inside here tonight at Conti Forum? Three-point game in favor of the Eagles. Well, we couldn't have asked for anything better, but this guy right here. Chapman had a double team on him as he tried to feed it down to Hamilton. Providence a chance to go back in front. Watson got it. Tie game at 55. Duke slices through some traffic and finishes with a left. Aaron, shot clock, down to two. Bowman delivers. Chapman. Hamilton. Got it. Two-point lead for BC. Here's Watson again, working on Hamilton. Goes baseline. Oh, the help comes. And a rejection by Mitchell. And tied up for the moment was Duke. Now to Watson. Jackson finishes it. Tie game again. 61 all. Jackson shut off. Feeds the cutter. It's Watson. The big guy. Yes. Off the window. Friars by two. Halfway through the second half. Three ball. Tabs. Count it. Chapman for three. Got it. How about the night Chapman is having 20 points for BC Jackson getting the feed from the top. And that's a beautiful read that time by Reeves. That's Providence a chance to come within one or tie with a three under seven minutes to go. Reeves on the take. Fouled and a chance to tie it at the free throw line. I'm trying to get a look down low for Watson. Let him go to work. Instead, it's Reeves for three and the lead for Providence. 6% from the free throw line tonight, and now Providence after the miss there, 11 to 17. Nice feed, Hamilton from Tavs. One point lead again for the Eagles, under five to go. White gets a step and finishes. Underneath, Hamilton, foul, count the basket. And it's out to Bowman with 10 to shoot. Bowman, tough runner, but it's going to go down. Duke on the kick out, wide open is Reeves, can't let that happen. He nails it. 145 left, Chapman, good job by Reeves on the close but he finds Hamilton. That could have really put the hurt on, here's Duke, quickly up the floor, and a foul! Basket counts from White. And then on the other end, I'm not sure how he got this one to fall. The ball out of Bowman's hands if I'm Providence in that situation. Easier Foul. said than done. Yes, though. exactly. Foul on White and Bowman missing the first. In that situation, though, obviously you want a tie ball game. You want to get the best shot available. And Find Reeves. Cut it underneath the basket. Coming off a screen. Thought about the three, drives it in, blocked, out to White, that is a three, no good, foul on the rebound, going the other way. Chapman is at the free throw line. 11.3 remaining, here we go. Providence, David Duke, down by three. Five seconds, Reeves for the tie, he got it! Heads up! And then at the end, you can't execute it any better than this. And again, it does not happen by mistake. Uh, that is execution, but that's by repetition. Pinned down, no communication that time by Boston College, and that is a big-time shot. 2.6 remaining. Bowman. Bowman for the win for BC. And we're going to overtime. Nice feed underneath. Basket of foul. Tabs gets a step. Crazy running out there, and rebounded by Watson. Duke, he's got Reeves ahead of the pack. 
Egg on side, everyone. Minute 35 remaining. Friars by two. Bowman to Chapman. Chapman for the tie. Five for six in overtime by him at the line. Five-point lead. Bowman launched it up a three. Not going to be there. Not enough. And Providence able to come away with a five-point overtime win.